What's going on guys? Welcome to another episode of the Costity Show. Just kidding. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Costity Show, Monday through Friday, as you know. Also too, be sure to like and subscribe so you can keep up with the current content going on every single day, Monday through Friday. So today, well, it's a sad day for me because it now marks like four months since I've last gone to a bar or any fun social activity in the state of Massachusetts. As you know, we have some of the strictest guidelines in place right now for social distancing. However, all across the country, not so strict. And I'm saying there's days I wake up in the morning and wish I lived inside these other parts of the country. You know, Florida and Texas and Arizona and all these places now have skyrocketing numbers and such. So we're going to take a look at some social distancing fails that would not fly in the great state of Massachusetts. Let's take a look. Well, taking a look, let's look at Hampton Beach here. Hampton Beach, as you can see here, is a uh, prime time, I don't know what to call this. Let me tell you this right now, anyone who's watched this that lives inside Massachusetts, you know that Governor Charlie Baker will be having a stroke or a conniption looking at this picture here. The rules in Massachusetts are much more strict. You gotta be at least like, what is it, six to 12 feet away from people's other blankets. Hampton here, they don't care. It literally looks like a packed beach out of a freaking Jaws movie. Don't even get me started on how many people are aren't even wearing face masks if you look closely enough when they're like sitting right on top of each other. But hey, what can I say? They're living their best life. All I'm saying is Governor Charlie Baker can't go anywhere near these parts of the countries or these beaches because he would, oh, that poor guy would be crying on his press conferences the next day. Let me tell you that. Well, look what we have here. Apparently, they don't even care what's going on inside restaurants. This restaurant here clearly doesn't give an F. They're open back up like it's 2004. My favorite part about this dude in the muscle shirt sitting there with the hats in the back with no mask on. That is definitely me if I lived inside this part of the country. It literally looks like a freaking Walmart inside here or a Shaw's or Costco or wherever you go grocery shopping and there's big lines like this. This is exactly what this looks like. Which makes me think to wonder like just, just other like states just don't believe that like this even exists. I went to Chili's in Massachusetts and let me tell you, every six tables are marked off, so there's like 40 feet in between people here. This, I don't even know what the hell this is. Plus, whoever took this picture looks like they're fearing for their lives. They're like, yeah, I'm gonna hang back way back here and let you guys all take that, uh, take the reins up there, take the brunt of that corona flying through in waves. Well, 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 would you look at this? A Donald Trump church gathering inside Phoenix. I'm not gonna get political inside this video at all. All I'm simply gonna say is, from a fact standpoint, there's not one thing you can or can't tell Mr. Trump, he don't care. His followers here, they don't care. Most of the people are diehard supporters, they don't even believe it exists. And frankly now, I don't know what to believe either. In the beginning of the month, we were having big gatherings and standings and protesting and there was a bunch of people together and there hasn't been spikes in coronavirus. So I don't know what to believe anymore. Mr. Trump doesn't think it's a big deal. Half the country thinks it's a big deal. I don't even know what to think anymore. Comment down below what you think. We should, are you guys like in favor of like, going out and having all these people. Are you in favor of staying home? Because I truly don't know. Bravo, right on. Look at this, more social distancing outdoor dining now. So we already covered one that was indoors. We're doing some outdoor dining. So you think outdoor dining get a little more lead way. You, know, you got outdoors, you can mark off your parking lot, whatever, the certain parts, you can put more tables out there. Oh God, no. I don't even know what, what, what is this? Who, who marked, who's measuring six feet? First of all, the tables are nowhere near being six feet away in distance. Don't even get me started on the people waiting in line that clearly aren't even six feet. And again, this brings me right back to my point. How come like state leaders don't send like officials of like the restaurant boards and stuff to go take a look at these places? Cause it makes me jealous. I am so jealous that I've been cooped up for four months and everybody all around the other states are living their best life that's not Massachusetts. Rising cases, lowering cases, who who knows? All I know is I miss this. If you miss this as well too, hit me up in the comments down below. Let me know what your state's doing. What is you guys' besides Massachusetts, like Arizona and Arkansas, I don't know. What are you guys doing right now? What's is like a restaurant's like 80%, 90, 25? What, what's going on with you guys? Let me know in the comments as well too. So of course we look at it, save the best for last. This is inside Tennessee. So this is considered a small concert they had. A small Concert. No kidding. Type it in. Tennessee concert on Twitter. This is the live footage of the concert. As you can see here, it looks like, I don't even know what, Coachella or something like that in the middle of a global pandemic. This is why I'm so convinced that I don't even know if this like COVID thing exists. What is this? Who, who authorized this? 
Clearly somebody did. Everyone's hands in the air, throw them in the air because they're living their best life. If this was like Fenway or something like this, I swear to God, I kid you not, my governor would be in a wheelchair after a heart attack, after just like driving by in his SUV and seeing this. If you were here, Definitely let me know in the comment section if you were here because if you were there I want to be there people out here getting sick by the thousands and states out here having whole ass concerts Come on, that's gonna conclude it for today's video Be sure to like also to subscribe so you get notified whenever I post up my new videos at 8 p.m On the east 5 p.m. On the west be sure to answer the questions I propose inside the video down below because I'm actually really interested to see what's going on Besides just in Massachusetts and like the New England states I like to know what's going on in other parts of the country because it seems like they're living their best life So comment down below what like do you guys get to go out to eat a lot? Do you guys get to like go out to bars? Are bars even open nightclubs like a just a social life? How's the social life going be sure to check back to, for tomorrow's video? I hope you guys enjoy be safe out there